This show was brought to you by Dharma Wheelies, Otter Poppers, It's My Milk in a Box, It's Leon Motherfucker, Phone Losers of America, Gobi, Fancy Pants, MST3 Clay, Gordo, Crispy808, and Mr. Turbois. Thank you to everyone for supporting the show. You can find out more at immoralhole.com. You can listen to our archives at travelswithmiriam.com. You can donate to us via Ko-fi, Patreon, cryptocurrency, or PayPal. All the links are on immoralhole.com. Hello. Hello. Hey, boss. Hello. Hello, sir. How are you? Yeah. I'm good. Yeah, you got that. You got the Jerry Springer chairs for sale. The one that he hit that girl with. You selling them? I don't know what you're talking about. I see you put an ad in the paper saying that you was no, selling I some don't. chairs. No, it wasn't me. Why you got why you got that ad in the paper? What's wrong with you? I don't. I don't got no ad no paper. Bubba, it's, your, uh, it's us, Bubba. We're out by the campfire. You can hear the crickets right now. We got the uh, wheels. You got for sale. We're what? looking for them wheels. We're looking for them wheels, my man. We're outside by the campfire right now. You can probably hear the crickets outside. Uh, it's me. Yeah. Yeah, you got them wheels. All right, let me put my son back on the phone. His name is Ted. We're out by the campfire. We're throwing knives at fences. All right, go ahead, Ted. Oh, you got them tires for sale, too? Or are they just the wheels? They're just wheels. Oh. How big are they? They're 16s. What happened to them? Why'd you take them off the car? They're uh, dually wheels. They're off of a truck. Uh, they had tires on them, and I bought them for uh, off a of Chevrolet. I bought them for a Ford. Bought the tires and wheels to get the tires for a forward truck. Well, put uh-huh. that down, Ted. Put that down. Oh, oh put that no. Down. Put that down. You just cut my fucking finger off. You stupid bastard. Oh, my God. Safety first. Did you ever hear that? Sir, these wheels... You didn't, like, go into a curb, smash them up, and then try to bang them back out into shape and then sell them, did you? Hello? Hello? Hey, me me and my son are going over his homework for uh, biology, uh, biology class right now, and we have a question. Where do you, where do you fart from? Hello? Hello? Do what now? Do what now? My son needs to know where do you fart from? A, it was your mouth. B, it was from your toes. And C, is from your ass. Hey, Ted, what's your number? Hello? 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 If you don't get a phone. I need to do my homework. I need to know, need know where you know are from. from. Answer the question Do what now? Do what now? Yeah, now? Yeah, do what now now? Yeah, what do you do what, John? Do what, John? What do we do now? What do we do now? What really sweet, caring person. I'm telling one to get billion. I'm not sure. I'm a great person. I'm on the phone with some girl. 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 I'm on the phone what are you doing, you doing? old cooter? Watching, watching TV. What, what, 
<laughs> yeah, what's yeah, on? What's are you on? watching, are you watching, watching the Walter Cronkite, Cronkite or something? Cronkite what are you watching? What are you watching? Fox News. Hey, 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 hey. Did you did just you, say fuck you? you? Yeah, did you hear did that you hear Biden that just, he, he just uh, resigned? Did you hear that? No, I didn't hear that. Yeah, yeah, he yeah, resigned yeah. due to his mental, his mental uh, decline. decline. And yeah. uh, Kamala Harris was now president as of 15, 15 minutes, minutes ago. ago. Hey, you're yeah. not hey, supposed you're to, tell, supposed him to tell him that. It's supposed to it's come to in come his cube. Oh, we did it. Oh, God, damn. Trump's back. <laughs> Do what? Hey, Do what now? Do what now? I was trying to tell you about Biden. Oh, I, I know plenty about Biden. Yeah, what do you know? You don't know nothing. I don't? Uh, uh, no, I, I heard that. It's still going on, but still echoing. Sir, your telephone line is horrible. Please stop Are selling things on the, the radio. Thank you. Oh, no. Yeah. Guess who you calling? Hello? Hey. I'm calling. I'm calling. I represent Joe Biden's campaign for 2024. What can we do to earn your vote? Yeah. We're good. Don't, uh, don't call me this late at night. Be good, good idea. Are you are you watching the Ingram Angle right now, you stupid fucker? Hello. Hello, Alex. Hi, Hello, ma'am. Alex. I'm I'm calling tonight uh, because we got a report that you've been participating in some racist activities, and we need to get your side of the story. Do what? Yeah, we got a report that you're do you're involved in some racist activities, and we need to get your side of the story before the uh, newspaper runs the story in the morning. Front page. It's gonna be front page. Hey, yeah. I I'm not a racist. I like That's everybody. That's the people said. The people the people said you were you were doing very racist and you were pulling your your eyes to the side to make them slanted and you were saying things against Chinese people. I like to, You people. know who you're talking to? Yes, I do. I do. And let me get a pen here so I can write this down. I want to put it in who the article. Who are you talking to? So you tell me we, by name. Your you your me. name. What? Yeah, tell me what, my what name if I'm supposed to be racist. Tell me what my first name is, last name. Your your name is Darlene. Wrong. You got the wrong number, sir. I got another racist. Do what now? You, yeah, got this is no bonus. We got an. Hey, sir. Yeah, we just. Hey, I'm not. Hey, let me look. tell you something. I'm not against black or white or eBay. I think we're all praying for God, you know. You're not so against don't be, eBay. You can print whatever you want to, but you got the wrong name. You go right ahead because you print something uh, with my name on it, and it's, not, not, and it's not me. I will sue you. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Right, you like right, not right, right, vanilla. Right. <laughs> Hello? Are you doing tips? You got those crickets. Um, you got those tapes for sale, honey. What tapes? You got the ad on the Craigslist. I apologize. I'm here with my friend. Right, he was just talking to you for a little bit. We got the crickets in the background. I was looking on your ad on Craigslist. No, honey, I don't got nothing on Craigslist. You got the wrong number. I don't think so, because my friend Dwight gave me your phone number and said, there's a whore that's ready to suck my old man dick. Oh, really? You Are you the fucking whore? Ma'am, listen. Yeah. Really? Huh? Hey, listen, you need you need to put your mouth on his piss pump right now. I command oh, really? you. I'm just throwing. I oh, command man. you. You should practice. You should, you should like a queer chef, eh? You know that? Are you a queer? <laughs> why, would you, why would you say that? Hey, do you suck dick sometimes? What up, Bubba? How you doing, Bubba? I got a canister for Mad right here. I'm going to pour a double shot for you, my friend. Wait a minute. I asked a question. You, you, you looking for dirt work? Dirt work? Sir? He asked you a question, dirt worm. You got the electric guitar for sale? Oh, hello? Or that? Or that? 
I'm going to put the guitar in the dirt and then have him sit down, and it'd be a nice stool for him. You better not play Stairway to Heaven on that guitar. Hello? How's it going, boss? What you got for sale? For My uh, my husband's looking for some stuff for sale. How you doing tonight? I'm good. Who's this? Good, bud. Uh, I'm just browsing the uh, the website right now. We're out camping right now. I apologize about the noise, but uh, yeah, we were looking on the uh, the list here. Saw you got something for sale. Okay. Uh, can you tell me? Because my wife told me just to call you and get something for her. I I know I see you got a lot of stuff. Uh, can you give me like a little rundown? I apologize, buddy. I'm looking for that free fucking firewood. Hello? Firewood. How you doing? Hello? I'm looking for that free firewood. I'm Dwight. Hello? You are? Mm-hmm. Hello? Yeah, doing. we're doing some firewood. We're in jail. Hey, we're in jail. You need to come bail us out, Grandma. I don't even know who yeah. you are. Grandma, it's me. We're in jail. We got caught drinking and driving. We're in jail. I'm looking I'm for that grandma. firewood. Grandma. I'm, hey, you're, you're a grandma when you got bail money. You got bail money? You're grandma. I think we got a cross line here. I'm looking for some firewood for sale. You got Werther's hard candies. You got bail it is, money. He's in jail. He wants money. No, I'm looking for some firewood. I'm not sure what that is. I'm Dwight. Oh, you're well, not. This is our only phone call. You got to come bail us out. I'm, I'm the young version of Dwight. Hello? We put a chimney sweeping log and lit it in this guy's asshole, and now he's just, he's, he's dropping all kinds of soot everywhere. Oh, fuck oh. me. Fuck me. How's it going, buddy? You selling propane? Hey. Are you, are you selling? Hey. Are you selling propane, my friend? No. Are you selling hay? Selling what? what? You're selling hay or propane? I'm sorry. My wife gave me two different texts uh, with two different numbers. I'm sorry. Are you selling neither of them? Oh, uh, no, I'm not. All right. Well, fuck yourself then. Oh, uh, fuck you too. No. Why? He, he, he offered at? a pretty fair assessment. He- Hello. Hey, how's it going, buddy? You're selling hay and kid saddles? Yes. Yes, sir. My name is John. Uh, I have my son here. His name is Ted. Uh, I shoot bow and arrow for a living. Uh, is that hay good? Is it for like feeding hay or is it more for like target practice? Could you tell me? I could do either one. What do you want? I've either one? That sounds hay. good. My, I've got hay uh, in the barn my, and I've got hay stacked outside. I, I, you know what? I'll take as much hay as possible because I, I, oh my God. I'll take as much hay as possible because my little buddy here, he's trying to shoot the bow, but also I got a new horsey. He's trying to ride the horse as well. So, like, is a saddle, like, kid-friendly, or is it more like a, an adult horse saddle? No, it's it's kid size. It's kid size. Okay, so I yeah. want to put him on the, the saddle on the hay and let my buddy Ted Webb ride the hay. Well, I shoot a bow and arrow at him, and I wasn't going to throw a saw blade at him. It'll sound like this. Hey, you said you were going to shoot the hay, not me. Why are you? Sh- why am I the target all of a sudden? Yeah, so I want to know how much you had for that. How much? Uh, what yeah, first? I, I, I apologize, sir. My my friend is he just discovered the fucking stories of William Tell. And so he, he keeps in there, he's like, oh, I'm William Tell, I'm William Tell, let me get the fucking, let me get a bow, let me get an apple. So now he's sitting there and he keeps trying, he keeps feeling up the apples. He's like, oh, this feels like the right apple, this feels like a good apple, it's a tight apple, it's a tasty apple. And he just goes on about apples, he's like Bubble Gump's friend from fucking uh, Forrest Gump, you know, he starts talking about shrimp, but he's talking about fucking apples. I have an apple orchard. So apple sauce, apple cider. Apple trees. Bye. Apple. Apple apples. Apple sauce. Apple sauce. Bye. Apple right, sauce. Adam's apples. Adam's <laughs> apples on women. Adam's apples on. 
over on to. Hello? Yeah. Hello? Hillbillies like this. Ah, you got the miscellaneous vegetables for sale? Hang on just a second. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Who's this? You got the... Well, this is Frankie. You got the miscellaneous vegetables for sale? Yeah. Uh, which vegetables you got? Oh, I got buttercup squash. I got zucchini, yellow squash. Uh, five different kinds. That's five disgusting. Different kind. What? That's disgusting. What else what do you, you got? Disgusting. Well, that's disgusting. Squash? No, I got onions. I got beets. I got cucumbers. Beets? That's disgusting. That's poor people food. Big dick. Who the fuck is this? The beet. Well, this is the Frankie. Beach. The beets, Daddy. They make me poo red. I don't want the beets. Well, that's not the beets, son. You have a condition. No, it's when I eat the beets, the poo comes out red. I got blood in my stool because I drink too much alcohol. Hey, fuck you. I stool and it comes no, out. You. Oh. Hello, greetings and salutations, sir. I'm calling about the beats that you have listed on Craigslist. Yeah? Yeah, I was calling to see how much a bushel they were and oh. approximately how much a bushel would weigh. I ain't got a bushel left. I got maybe half a bushel. Half a bushel of beets? Yeah. Okay, and how like are are they like how do you prepare them? Because this is my first experience with beets. Are they boiled or fried or baked? I'm not sure how to, how to prepare. You can them. do them any way you want. Okay, but how long after I consume the beets does my my shit look red like it's blood because I drink too much? Hey, who is this? I'm your father, Peckerhead. I drink too much alcohol now. My shit's turning red. Cause them damn beats that I shoved in my head. And I take a sip of whiskey, here we go, let's go. Oh damn, that was good. Now I'm gonna get them beats in my asshole. He drinks the he drinks the whiskey in order to disinfect his hemorrhoids. That's why there's blood in his shit. And I said, hey, yo, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, yo, whoa, whoa, whoa. Daddy, you shouldn't be using power tools when you're drunk. Uh, that's probably actually, Ted, that's probably a good idea. All right. Bye. Hey, Hello? beat man. Yeah. Just beat it. Hello, Just Redneck. Just beat it. Redneck, so, hello? You can <laughs> eat all the beats that you can. Redneck. Redneck. What Your mom Iowa told you, you she's a woman, but she is a man. What part of Iowa? I'm from Des Moines. I'm from Des Moines. I'm from Des Moines, motherfucker. <laughs> in Iowa. You sound like you ought to be drowned in the fucking river, you cocksucker. Hey, listen, I'll plant you in the cornfield, you son of a bitch. You understand me? <laughs> Don't be saying some Iowa shit like that. I'll plant you in the cornfield and let the Hawkeyes get at you. I'm gonna put uh, you in a rose bush. Make make you all look nice. I'm gonna make you look nice and pretty. Hey, fuck You're gonna you. look real gay this weekend when the Michigan Wolverines come down there and just beat the shit out of your football team. You know that? I'm gonna name a rose after you. Hello, asshole. Is that is that threatening? Sorry. Never mind. I'm gonna just name, I'm gonna I'm gonna name a rose after you. That's all I'm gonna do. I'm going to I'm gonna put you in the cornfield and let Isaac from Children of the Corn come in there and tell you about the man who walks behind the rose, and you're going to be... Malachi! I'm going to take you to Ogden Marsh, where the crazies live, and I'm going to play Ogden Marsh baseball. Please, I'm, I'm going to take you to Toledo, Ohio, and... Yellow. Hey. Yellow. Hello? Yellow. I need you to get your compressor and you come up my tractor. I got a fucking flat tire. Get your compressor and come down here. You got the you. wrong number, dude. You got the no, wrong no. Number. I'm I'm Amish. I can't operate a compressor to pop the. But I do have a tractor. That's 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 weird. I need you to come and pump, you know, pump my tire up there. Come.
come help. I need to do a shop. I'm playing video a games at the same time. Uh, 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 he's doing a shot put. Whoa! Can't put the fucking video games away, okay? You can't, new. Yeah, put the punk console away. Put your racist game away. Thanks for calling home what? and suits. How can I help you? Hello, Chutia Sala Gandu. How are you? Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm with your mother and your sister right now, and uh, she's washing Master. my lunch. Master Shod? You should come. You should come, come front. Start it, and then I'll transfer it to the poll. Give it in. Can I have a home help you, sir? Hey, how's it going, buddy? My name is James. Uh, I'm calling from I Do What I Want Towing. Uh, apparently, there's like a crazy car parked in your parking lot. Oh, my goodness. It started spinning around on wheels. And we're sending a, tro a tow truck over there unless you guys can hold on the phone so we can get you to my corporate office. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes. Okay. So please hold while I get you my trans my corporate office so we don't have to charge you. We're going to charge the resident, okay? Oh, my goodness. Please hold. Um, I'm if you have a problem and you just got a phone call, we're going to make sure that towing gets done. Please hold your caller number. One. Uh, 17. Please continue to hold. Uh, so I got a customer. Yeah. <laughs> Customer service, how may I help you? Hello, Chutia, Gandu, Banchot, hello. Yes, sir, I got a customer, yeah, tell me, sir. Oh, hello, yes. This is customer service, how can I help you, Gandu? Hello. Hello, Chutia, how are you? Yeah, I'm good. Oh, good, yes. This is customer service. How can I help you? Uh, is the other guy called me regarding the P? I I don't know. It's, uh, key okay, you know. please hold. Thank you for calling Big Truck Towing. If you have a car out in the parking lot spinning sideways, that's no good. We're going to make sure we help you out. Please ignore the crickets. You are call number out of 70,000. Please continue to hold. A representative will be with you with a quickness. Here we go! Thank you for calling Big Truck Tow and how are we doing today? Hello. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Uh, did you, you got transferred back to me. Is everything, did it get taken care of? Sorry, sir, I could not hear them properly. So once you come here, then we can uh, speak, I can speak with them, sir. This oh, no, office. sir. Sir, we're in the parking lot right now. Uh, we have two truck, tow trucks here right now. I was trying to transfer my, uh, my, my one tow truck driver to White. Uh, if you could please hold real quick. Uh, he's gonna pick up the car right now. It's spinning around. Please hold. Sir, it's not the towing truck. I think. Where are you, sir? Please, I do. Please hold. Please hold. Please hold. Please hold. Listen. Thank you for holding the big truck and tow, where we get it done. We dream by the church bells. Please continue to hold. Our representative is right there. We're gonna fuck you up. Customer service, how may I help you? Can I have your ID? 
Hello? Hello? Customer service? Sir, I am busy right now. I'm getting regular customers, so... Yes, this is customer service. How can I help you, sir? Uh, it's the towing truck guy called and he kept me in the towing line. Towing truck? Sir, this is Microsoft Technical Support. How can I help you? Hello? Hello. Please hold. Yeah. Thanks for calling Microsoft Customer Support. We're here to help you in partnership with Bounty Box and Big Truck Towing. We're going to put a fish right in your ass. And also, Dwight the janitor is going to come and get you. There we go. Because, my God, I think that was you, man. Thank you for choosing Wing It by Wyndham. This is Becky. How may I assist you today? Oh Hello. my God, Becky! Did you see her butt? <coughs> what? It was just so round. It was just so round and big. Oh my God! Who is this? Oh, it's Dwight. I, I'm the criminal. That's that's what I got put in jail for. Was I observed a lot of females. Uh, rectums through their pants and uh, they put me in jail. Okay, I'm hanging up now, okay? Have a good night. Back. There he is, man. Call us all of you. Fuck you. Hello. Hello. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Uh, we just booked a room about maybe three hours ago. Can you hear uh -huh. me? Yes. And I booked a room three hours ago, me and my cat, and my husband Dwight, and my fish, and my gun, and my guy with a weird hat, and Gordo. We booked a hotel room. Oh, and a clown, too. We booked a hotel room for the uh, the event that's going on in the lobby. Do you know anything about that? What's your name, sir? My name is James Smith. Uh, if you could look up our hotel room, Smith. I'm gonna fuck you. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. We're done on our room. We're in the elevator right now. Uh, yeah, we're, sir, we're 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 uh, amateur mermaids. Yeah. And we've we've filled our room. We we got a bunch of flex seal and we sprayed all the surfaces in our room so it's watertight. And now yeah. our room is just a big aquarium. So we have people swimming in our room. And I'm trying to cut us out right now because there's water filling up past our heads. Oh, shit. Oh, What's your room number? What? What's your room number? It's 12. Yeah, we're, we're, in, uh, we're in the Benchode suite. Matt Benchode? Yes. We're on floor Marachode in the Benchode suite. Hello, Extended Stay America. This is Penny. How can I help you? Hey there, Penny. Uh, I have a problem in my room. Could you look up my reservation, please? Um, okay, what's your room number? Uh, the last name is, is Atric, A-T-R-I-C. What's name is the Barry. room number? What's the room number? I, well, that's part of the problem is some jokester kid has removed the numbers off the outside of my room. That was the first thing I was calling about. Oh, my word. Um, I know, I know. Could you look it up by my name? I can. What's your last name again? A-T? At A-T-R-I-C. First name is Barry. You're not, you're not here at our hotel. Did you get the name correct? I did, but you're not at what's our the, hotel. What's the, what, what's, what's, the, what's the name? Extended Stay America. No, no, my, 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 my name, my, my name, my name. Barry, I can look it up by Barry. 
Yeah, yeah. And no, there's no very Barry. What is my Atric. what is my last name? Yeah, Barry. That's me. I'm Barryatric. Hello. You're not here. What's wrong? What's wrong with your eating habit? How many cat? Stop eating. <laughs> Oh, hello. How are you doing tonight, honey, baby? Oh, I'm doing good. Oh, are you honey? No, I'm not honey. Oh, can you be my honey? No. Baby. Sorry. Hello? Oh. Hello. Hello. For I'm looking for Chin. <laughs> Yeah, I'm oh, looking yeah. for Chin. Okay. Uh, can you please repeat it again? I do what now? Uh, you want? I want Chin. Chin. Yes, Chin. Do you have Chin? No, no, no. I don't have. Okay, do you have hand? No, no. Do you have eye? No. Do you have teeth? We'll run through all the bodies. Confident, Miss Miracle speaking. Hello, ma'am? Yes. Hello? Yeah, hi. Yes. The man who's standing in the room above me, he just he just cut a hole in my ceiling and he's trying to install a fireman's pole. Huh? Yeah, he cut, like, and he must have cut in his floor, which is my ceiling. He cut it up, and now there's a hole in my ceiling, and he's putting a fireman's pole into my room. Okay, give me one second. Now, he keeps saying he's going to slide down and see me sometime, but I don't understand what this is all about. What room are you in? Uh, I'm in 110, and I'm, I would guess he's in 210 if he's above me. But like like I said, he, he cut out a three foot by three foot square and he he has a brass pole. He's he's sliding it down to my room and he's asking me to secure it. He's dropped a bag of cement down here and he says, Cement it in, cement it in. I don't know what to do. Okay, give me one second. Okay, but what do I do? Because he he's got the air conditioning going on in there and it's very cold down here now. I'm, oh, I'm very okay. hurt about this. Okay, I'm finna calm. Just give me a sec. I'm coming. What's your, what's okay, your name? Like, what what is he doing now? Uh, hey, what's your put, name? Put that. Hang on. He's he's got tools. What? Hey, put that down. What's, it's making a lot of noise. What's uh, your my, name? My name. My last name is Atrick. Who? First name Barry. I'm Barry. Last name spelled A T R I C. He's going crazy. He's got he's got he's got okay, a lot I'm of coming. tools. I'm coming. Hey. Hello? He's got a drill now. Hey, Hello. don't, hey, don't, hey, don't yell at me like that, motherfucker. Apologize. Apologize now. Yeah, why are you talking Hello? like that? Yes, go ahead. Because you, cur you, cursed at, you cursed at me when you picked up. You called me a marachod when you picked up the phone. Yeah, who said? You say. No, I didn't say anything. 
Yeah, when you picked up the phone, I heard Madar Chod, and I know that means motherfucker. No, I am not talk like that. Why are you talking like that? Okay. I am not talk like that. So you didn't, you didn't, you didn't say Madar Chod. No, I didn't talk like that. Not one time. Oh, also no, he, he said. What is your room he number? He said Bakri. He said Bakri Chod. That's no. what he said. What is we're in one fi- we're, 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 hey, hey, we're in one fifteen. Why don't you close? Why don't you close your fucking mud flat mouth? Okay, stop it. Yeah, why are you talking like that? Don't talk like that. I'm drunk. <laughs> like, I'm drunk. I'm drunk. I'm love with your sister. Yeah, bye, bye, bye. Don't talk me. What, what the I'm fuck? I'm your buffy. I'm your buffy. Today. Hello. Thank you for calling, my sister. How may I help you? Hi. Does your hotel have the radio in the room? Uh, you see? walk in the door and it goes Is that how it goes when I walk in through the door? You greet me? Heck, uh, may I know your room number, sir? Oh, I'm not there yet. I'm I'm coming in very soon. I am driving my car. I'm here with my <laughs> family. We're in the station wagon. <laughs> Uh, I, I've been drinking, mm-hmm. you know, yeah. Coca-Cola. I prefer Diet Coke. Yeah. He puts rum in the Coca-Cola, though. No, I don't. I'm driving. I can't drink and drive. That's illegal. Yeah. yeah. You're right. Yeah. So, uh, you have rooms for booking? Uh, no, sir. We are sold out. Oh, fuck! You don't have rooms for hooking? Oh, yeah. We want to bring um, clients back to the... Uh, I do need to make a video of... Uh, Hello? A, Hi, Corey, I'm Marriott. You think she'll come make the video, too? We have a video that needs to be made. Hi. H- Hello? How are I'm you? I'm doing all right. How are y'all? Hi. I got the oh, hand we're doing great. camera. I got the old school. What's this crank the hand Yeah, uh, we're having some issue with our GoPros in the room here. We're trying to film some action shots. Oh. And the memory card keeps getting corrupted. Yeah, I got this 1847 GoPro. Yeah, so what was going on was uh, Dwight was going to do like somersaults naked, all funny, crazy like. And I was going to catch it on GoPro. Okay. Are y'all guests here? Yeah. What room is it? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. What room are you in? 215. We don't have a 215. You said 215. We don't have a 215. Well, oh, I'm sorry. I read it wrong. I read it wrong. It's 125. Sorry, I'm dyslexic. No, you're good. Do You, you do know I can see your phone number, correct? You can see? Wow, that's great. Hey, hang, um, hang up, hang up. Mom's going to fucking kill us. Oh, no. Okay. We get caught doing prank phone calls again. Tell me to fucking block it. Y'all have a great I night. I star 69 did. Thank you for calling us enough to extend it. Thank you for calling us enough to extend it. Speaking of my interview. Uh, 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 what? Hello? Hello? Sanelsa, extend the stay hammer. I help you. Wait, what's the name? Thank you for calling Fairfield Fort Smith. Hello. Hello, thank you for calling Fairfield Fort Smith. Hi, um, I'm having trouble with the Craftmatic adjustable bed in my room. All right, let me see. And what room are you in? In 215. The bed has got me like sandwiched up like a taco and I can't get it to stretch back out again. Well, sir, who are you trying I to like contact? What- who are you trying to contact? Well, I'm trying to contact the front desk because I need help adjusting the Craftmatic bed. See, I like to watch all in the family and, um, you know, Sanford and son while I'm in my Craftmatic adjustable bed and yeah. it, it's malfunctioning. Yeah, we tried the Ouija board, but that didn't work. So then we called the front desk.
Yeah, I tried to contact David through the Ouija board. Oh, yeah. And uh, he said that there was... Hey, 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 while he's telling his story, don't you fucking oh, hey, oh yeah him like that, all right? You just sit there and listen like a good little dust jockey. Yeah, so there's... David's like our friend in the Ouija board. He's like the spirit of a young boy, he's like 10 years old or something. But then there's this other guy who's like evil and pretends to be him. So I, I don't know who I'm talking to most of the time. You're not, you're not him, are you? Hello, Wayne. Can I help you? Oh my Hello? God. Oh. Hi. Hello? Can I help you? Yeah, some man keeps knocking on my door, and when I open it, he's in a pirate costume with a wood board on the floor and tells me I have to walk the plank. I did a, a flushing machine call. Yeah. Hi, listen, I, I just need to give someone warning. I'm about to flush about three of your, uh, your, your uh, towels down the toilet to cause some real, real big damage. And I just wanted to put you on alert that there may be a fuck is that annoying? I think, do you have a telegraph coming in? Is that for Marty McFly? Are you going to deliver it on the road there when it's raining? And you're going to be like, oh, look, look what I have. No, that's our office phone. That's your, what the, what's wrong with the office phone? That's just is the it, noise that it, it makes. Oh, Oh, okay. It does it have the uh, Michael J. Fox disease? Is that what's going on? Okay, what room are you in? Oh, I'm in two fifteen and it's about to be it's about to be wet. That's what she said. Yeah, she did say that. Just to confirm. Your your office phone sounds like a machine gun. It, it's the office phone printing out the messages it receives. I think the, the office okay, phone is, is printing this? in fucking Braille right now. <laughs> Tell your Braille phone to calm the fuck down while we talk. Who is this? My it's name like is a, Dwight. It's like a Flintstones phone. Is it like carving words on a metal, on a, on a tablet yeah, or something? Yeah, that's, some, like that's, that's fucking yabba dabba do fantastic right there. Yeah. I feel that her phone's mocking me. I think her phone knows I'm blind, and she's got the Braille phone going off right now. Are you mocking me because I'm blind? Who is this? My name is Dwight, and I'm a blind man, and I weigh 215 pounds. I weigh the same as you. You. Yep. Yep. So. Fucking. Quality, and how can I help you? What are the qualities, though? Yeah, and what are they in? There is a uh, customer hey, service. you know what? We're going to get the police to trace well, this phone number. Hey, 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 listen here. Fuck the, police. Fuck the listen police. Fuck the police. Listen here. You understand me? I'm... But I'd rather not. Hello? Thank you for calling Courtyard by Marriott Downtown. How can I help you? Hi, who is this? This is Amanda. Hi, Amanda. Ha, ha, ha. Let me put you on with my brother because I'm very high and I can't follow the conversation anymore. God damn it, Patrice, you get back in your goddamn cage right now. I'm going to have the front desk come up here and feed you. Is Hello? that, hi, Amanda? Mm-hmm. Is this Amanda Hug and Kiss? Is that you? That's <laughs> Papa 96, Jason. Now we help you. Hey, Jason, just a quick uh, question. Do, do you watch any, uh, like, I guess, procedural documentaries or shows like Law & Order SVU, uh, CSI, or anything like that? Do you have any experience in, uh, uh, as an attorney or if you watch a lot of attorney shows, uh, Judge Judy, maybe? No. Okay. Um, I was just wondering, what do you think the um, – uh, the legal charges I would be facing, theoretically, if I was locking a grown woman named Cat into a dog crate. Cat, meow. Yeah, we're throwing Hello? we're throwing uh, the things off the balcony. The we found the, the yeah. The, 
Yeah, man, I mean, we're throwing cats trip. off the balcony to make sure that they land on their feet. We're it's testing the theory of gravity. Yeah. That's all drunk to while. Yeah, drunk to while, Dwight. Okay. Thank you for calling Super 8. This is Sam. I'm helping. Hello. Hi, Sam. How are you doing tonight? Good, good. Oh, good. So, I'm just going to preface this with by saying, um, I I think this is good. I think we're all good here, but uh, here's what's going on in the room. We're flushing the sheets, and uh, there's doo-doo water everywhere. What do I do? Where? It, right here in the room. We're Which flushing room? the sheets. Oh, the bathroom. Which room is it? Yeah, it's the bathroom here. Yeah. I know, but yeah. what's the room number? Uh, do you, did you see that kid take the room numbers off the door? Because that's that wasn't. Yeah, us. he 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 flushed the room numbers. What's your room well, number? Sir, can I? Room we're in. Sir, these scissors that I borrowed to cut the sheets into little pieces of toilet paper, they're they're not very I sharp. I know. What's your room number, sir? I have been asking. Uh, it's number two, I... Sam. Sam, Sam, it's number two. Thank you, Sam. Please and thank you. Which room number two? Here at the Super 8? We don't have number yeah. two. Well, we're going number two in the in the bathroom. No, it's, is it a number one or two or number two? Yeah, that one. The first one you said. Which there's one? There's so much brown water. 102, there's yeah. Like, there's brown water all over the floor. It's like seeping into the carpet. It's just cocoa water. You can drink it. Here, take a glass and drink some of the water. No, from the it's... Smell icky. Okay, what's no, your it. what's your name? Tell me. What's oh, your my name? Yeah. My name is Baba. Just get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Days in Clinton, this is Marilyn. Uh, hello, hello. Yeah. I'm I'm looking for this girl who came to my room and she arranged my bed and made it very nice and neat. How can I help you? She, well, she like I wanted to give her a tip. Uh, she was a woman. She was uh, Hispanic and had a mustache, and she smelled it like garlic. Okay, what is your question? I wanted to give her a, like a monetary a tip, like, cause she has a hairy RMB tits, bro. What room are you in? I'm in the 111 and she cleaned my room earlier and I had a bunch of a, a, a beer bottles and an Indian curry laying around in my room and she cleaned it real nice. Okay, um... I want to give her some money for uh, the offer menu, the offer menu thing that she left here at the room. Oh, I no, that order, is okay. Order on, I want to order a number two, bro. I didn't know what the hell. Hello? Hey, I'm Sven. This is Randy. How may I help you? Oh, you're cheery as fuck. Are you doing, are you having a good night? Oh yeah, I get off in five minutes, so I'm having a great night. Oh fuck yeah! Hey, hey, me too. But that's her biggest complaint. <laughs> what can I do for you? I don't know. This is going to be a horrible prank call. But if you're getting off, you know, uh, have a good night. You know, and we're going to hang up. No, we're not. <laughs> Holiday Inn Express and Clinton. This is Kim. Can I help you? Hey, hey. Have you seen my wife armpit down there at all? I'm sorry, her what? My my wife, her name is Armpit. You would know her. She's she's like five foot two. She has long armpit hair, it's braided, that's why they call her armpit. She smells of garlic. Okay, I think you're uh... she, she 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 looks she looks like she has a spray tan, but she uses uh, I can't believe it's not butter instead of uh, bronzer. Okay, is this a prank call? No, it's a real call. She's been gone for twenty minutes, and she was just supposed to go down to the ice machine. 
Okay, what room are you in? Because well, I'm in one ten, and she kept telling me I was going to the hell, and I said, "Well, you better go get some fucking ice." Then that's what I told her. Well, you can ask for. We're calling only King Ten Clinton. This is Jason. How can I help you? You can't say that anymore. That's racist. Hello. Yeah. Hi. How do you work for you? another company? Yeah. Is this your only job, or do you have another job? I feel this guy works for the Holiday Inn, and he's picking up the front desk phone trying no, to. No, 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 because he sounds in. super familiar to someone that was like on help desk. Oh, I, I apologize, but no, this isn't my only job. Is there anything I can? You help don't you have with to that? apologize for your voice, dude. It's okay. Yeah, maybe you need it's, a third it's awesome, job. Actually, it's just very familiar. That's all. So I'm sorry to oh. interject. I'll leave it. I'll leave oh. it back. I'll hand it back to my brother How here. Much, this motherfucker needs a third job. Hey, you want a third job? No, he's right. Hey, er hey Ernie, you want a job? What kind of job? He's I don't right. Know. He sounds familiar, dude. So I don't know if he could should take. He's a job. guy. He's the guy. He's the guy who couldn't fix the cable modem and told us to go fuck ourselves. This is the dude, guy. It's, it's possible. It's very uh, possible. He said he's not the guy. He d he doesn't have a second job. Get off his back, man. He's only got one job. What a lazy guy. What is he hey, if well, you can make is, it with no. one job and doesn't have to take four Bill, like you sucking dick, Bill. then uh, all what, more one power job, to One job? What is he on? Welfare? All right. I said Bill. I hand it back. My bad. What? Oh, shit. He knows. Is this Bill? Do your, it's not, do your it's job. Not you're not, sorry to interrupt. You're, you're, you're on a flow. You're on a flow. Do your thing. Yeah, it's not Bill. It's not Bill. It's not Bill? It's not, it's it's not, it's not Bill. You, oh. you don't... How do you, why do you think it's Bill? Why not? Dude, have you heard? Did, wait a minute. Did my we, name did, isn't Bill. My name is not Bill. Did you plug Fine. the fucking number before we called? All right. Are you going to offer me up or not? Well, I'm listening. Do you know where Will, we can William get William Tell? Pardon? It's you William need to quit speaking over each other, then I wouldn't be able to really understand you guys. Oh, hey, don't. Hey, listen, listen. I don't come to your job and slap the cock out of your mouth. Don't tell me how to do my job. Is this your job? Yes, it is actually. Sad. That's that's pretty sad. I'm, I do t I do these for TikTok. I do it for the lulls. I make I make sponsor money. You 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 stutter or over every call. I tell yes, and I tell people how to lower their bills. <laughs> nice. That's why my is name is Bill Tell. No. Oh, because you're 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 incompetent. You're working too many jobs and too little pay and too many resources. Your credit sucks and it's in the oh. toilet. Yeah, you, I, you I, have I, at least I, thirteen I, jobs. Yeah, you need you need to talk to JG Wentworth. Uh, you need to have like thirteen now? jobs. Hmm? Yeah, exactly. That old uh, motherfucker who had the he was on the bus. He had the bus driver outfit on, and he had the chin and the gray hair. Yeah, him. So when are you going to fix our internet connection, Mother Chooch? You have to call the proper number for me to work on that. What's the proper number? I told you it was this guy. What is, is. What is your number? I told him that the download speeds were too slow, and he's like, well, maybe you should spend more on your internet. Yeah, yeah. You got know, all he told he's like, oh, oh, you're getting 70% of your speeds, and that's in the acceptable range. That's what he told me. And I was like, he said, I was if like, you got oh, any yeah. more internet, you'd get fat. Yeah. He said, he told me internets were loaded with carbs. And I told him, yeah, like his Only girlfriend said that his. Oh, yeah. But his whoa, girlfriend whoa, said whoa, that whoa, his whoa, penis whoa. was in an acceptable range. Word? Did he just say the J word? I don't know. What's your favorite J word? Geronimo. Oh, I don't believe that starts with Jugular. J. Jugular. No, that's a good one because that's what they that's what the code name was for Osama bin Laden when they smoked his ass. Mm -mm. That's never been proven. Yes, it has. You don't trust Obama? Um, Obama said uh, so. That's true. I'm sure you believe everything, everything every politician says. Hey, I watch you CNN. Like I watch rep I watch reputable news. Okay, I watch the Young Turks sometimes, but mostly CNN. <laughs> I watch the Weekly World News. I don't watch that fucking Fox News bullshit. Nice, nice. Like nice. Bat Boy is real. I like I, I I read Weekly World News. 
No, you you ever uh, sit there and you watch Greg, the like that Greg friends. Gutfield guy? He just makes fun of he makes fun of the news like people are dying in Ukraine. He's over here cracking jokes. Fucking Greg Gutfield, he's an ass. He needs to be like Chris Cuomo. Chris Cuomo brings the news and he's fit. He's physically fit and he's into keeping himself and his mind and body for- strong. It's really hard to understand you. Why you got a hearing aid? Do you need me to speak up? Yeah. No, I think it's probably that you're too boisterous. Then, uh, then I can't hear you properly. Boisterous? Are you no saying people. I'm? Are you saying I'm gay? You saying that it is exposed? It's out there? Are you saying he's a centaurian? That's yeah. a crossword. If you like to, yeah. if you like half, to pronounce it horse. that way, that more than well, more than welcome to. I have, yeah, I'm a half horse and I'm a half man, a centaurian. Oh, uh, centaur or reverse centaur? No, no, centaurian, sanatorium. Is that a sexual position, reverse centaur? Um, that would be the question to ask your partner. No, I want to ask your partner. Uh, they're not. But wait a minute, which 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 bot which bottom is which part is this is the horse? Like, do I? Is it like that horsey cat thing that we saw? It, it, it sounds like I'm speaking to a horse's ass, so I'm assuming. But I rather oh! but, but but if I was, then I would have the horse cock too, though. So you, you I mean, ta-da! That's why I said you, ta-da. Huh. Cool. What's the matter, you guys? If you if, if y'all want to continue on, if y'all want to continue on this bit, I I really request y'all come up with something good. If not, I'm gonna have to let you guys go. I'm gonna have to go on 4chan. I got to do some research. You sound like someone right. who might LARP, you know? Are you a LARPer? Uh, I wouldn't know what you're... Is it a LARPing? That's that's uh, when a fat person goes to a Chinese buffet for all you can eat. Oh, I have a uh, a job, so I don't believe I'm one of those. You don't, you don't spend no. your money wisely, then, if you don't go to... A LARPer is live-action role-play. Do you go out into the forest oh. and, like, pretend you're... An elf, like elf. Oh, Elfo you're and... you're you're one of those furry people, huh? No, I was saying that you're a larper. Oh, yeah. I apologize. Larping is what Chris Chan did with his mother until it went too far. Yeah, he was Oof. role playing. He was role playing his dad. Ha ha! That's what happens whenever you eat those kiwis. Oh no! The kiwis. He, he knows what we're racist. talking about. He's talking about the farms of the kiwis. Oh, that is talking about island people. Come on, guys! I, I'm really gonna need something. If not, I'm gonna have to let you guys go. No, we want we want to get you like in trouble and written up for being on the phone too long. That's where we need to be get you. We're gonna we're gonna doctor the paperwork to make it look like you were calling gay sex lines while you were at work. Uh, I already have y'all's phone number and everything, so it really doesn't matter. We're not a gay sex line. I yet. I guess that's enough proof for me then. Touch it. Touch, Touch it. it. Touch 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 it. Oh yeah. Do you, touch, fucking do you touch, touch it? The cheetah. The cheetah. Let's all touch it together, guys. The cheat. It's touch time to touch. touch. Once again, guys, touch if it. y'all are just gonna touch speak it, speak over y'all selves. It's, uh, touch it. Uh, yeah. really yeah. it's time to touch yeah. it. Listen. Yeah. Do you t- do you balls, touch balls, it? Balls, balls, balls of steel. Balls of steel. Oh, that's so 1992. Yeah. Oh, time thank you touch. for taking up the reference. Thank you, guys. Yeah, you I still have to let you guys go. We love you. Uh, yes. So call me back, and we'll see what we can do. Thank you. All right. Bye, Say it back. We love you. See you, Duke. I'll take it easy. We can do the reverse sense. All right. All right. Oh, yeah. We love you. Say it back. The creature. Bye, Bill. Bye. Rude. Oh, no. Looking to Sweet Town City. How can I help you? Hey. Oh. You need to respect my Cherokee heritage because I'm a warrior, like Chris. Okay. I'm dance for you. Yeah. yeah. Sir, we hooked up a car battery up to our television to try to get a high-def 4K picture. 
and the TV uh, kind of cracked in the smoke. And then I threw it out the window because it caught fire. 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 Phone call. Hello? Okay, hello. Hi. How are you doing tonight? Pretty good. Okay, good. Do you have any vacancies, first off, before I waste any of your time? Yes, we do. Oh, perfect. I'm here with my family in my station wagon. We've been driving all day. Uh, we're going to be in, around your area in about 25 minutes. Uh, can we book a room? Is that okay? Can we do that through you? Because our phones are not working. Yes. Okay. I'm talking you through the the cars. You know, it has a phone yeah, we have, built in. We, we have cu we have cup phones in the in this car. Yeah, you can hear we everything. Ran oh. the station wagon. Yeah, so it's, I'm gonna put you on. I'm gonna put you on with my brother. He'll take care of the uh, thing. I have to yeah, I may be a little late, guys. I might be a little late because I'm currently on the International Space Station. It's gonna take yeah. me a while to get there. And and, and ma'am, the shitter's full. <laughs> okay, so. Uh... Let me get your name and your phone number. Uh, uh, I forget. My name is Buzz. Buzz Aldrin. Buzz Aldrin, huh? Yeah. Okay. I'm the I'm the uh, the the cousin from uh, National Lampoon Vacation, but I, I'm blanking on my name right now. Oh, okay. But he was played. He was played by Randy or uh, Randy Quaid, or Dennis. the one that went crazy and had a long beard. Him and his wife believe there's aliens and they're trying to butt fuck her. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, cousin, cousin Eddie. Yeah, I'm cousin Eddie. That's that's me. Oh. But th but that's true. That, that's true. You should protect your rectum, though. The aliens are ruthless. So are y'all wanting to rent a room? Yes, absolutely. Okay. And you want to put it under Buzz but, Aldrin? No, put it under Uncle or uh, Uncle Cousin Eddie. And his brother's sister wife. Your father, how to call? Motel. Hey, hi, hi. How you doing? Pretty good. Oh, good. I um, damn. I thought you were gonna be Hindi. Are you Indian? Yes. Oh, oh, good, good. Hey, uh, how long does it teach your bop to fuck? Sorry. How long does it teach your bop to fuck? Okay. <laughs> Don't don't talk like that, okay? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, uh, uh, how long did it take your bop to chod? Yeah, use a proper word. I'm sorry. <laughs> Do I pay, man? Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Uh, Hello. Can I pay someone to slap me? What? Hello. Yeah, if I come down to the front desk and I pay you five dollars, will you slap me on the face? It's nothing weird. It's just I need to be woken up. I'm not sure if I'm asleep or if I'm like dreaming. I'm yeah, kind of worried. Yeah, please hang up phone. Well, can you slap me? Yeah, call the cops and they're gonna slap you. No, 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 no. I want you to slap me. Yeah. With your luscious hands. And the ass. Damn, the hang up the phone. Which <laughs> <laughs> phone? S6 may help you. Hello. Uh, hi. Um. Yeah. Hi. Have have you seen the ghost of my cat in your hotel? Yeah, it's in your home. No, 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 it, no, no, mother. Listen. The hologram shit. Hello. Several country in. Hello, country in. You have vacancies for my whole. Yes. Family. Yes. My oh, uh, my family consists of several holes. I have them here in the in the station wagon. Everybody say hello. Hi, hole. Yeah, hi. Hi, hole. hole number one. We are a uh, homosexual. I have a big hole. 
Good jerk. <laughs> hey, hi. Yeah? Do you have do you have hair that you comb? What? Do you have hair that you run a brush through? What? Hello? Ma'am? Are you, are you a horse? Hello, hello, stu stupid bitch. Hello? Friend Pinota, hello. He's sleeping with his wife. Sounds painful. <laughs> That's gonna happen anyway. Lester Marshall, I'm happy. Hello? Hi, the Chinese government wants to rent rooms. Chinese government wants the room? Yeah. Give us the room or the Chinese government. Room for the Chinese government? Yes. If okay. you don't give us you if you don't give us the room, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get our tanks to treat you like, like the square. What is that Tiananmen Square? We're gonna treat you just like it. Uh, just uh, treat me like a Russian Tiananmen Square, or, or you can go, go. Hey, go hey, hey! Are you else. even, are you even listening? <laughs> are you even listening? Did anybody say anything about Russia? You Vladimir Putin fucking apologist, you loyalist you son of a fucker, bitch. You fucker! You motherfucker! Hey, listen, L listen, listen, <laughs> listen, motherfucker! You motherfucker, listen, listen to me, fucker! Okay, you go. You go to you hell, go, and then I'll go. You go to hell. Yeah. I don't want to go. And you die. Hell. Yeah. I don't want to hang up, too. Make sure you bring GPS. I, I have all night. Hey, hey this is, this, be quiet. This, this is Taco Bell. You want to you wanna go to Mexican government? No, Ta no. We are, we are better there are no Mexicans at Taco Bell. Fuck we will steal you, your man. ways of running. To, hey, 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 listen, okay, motherfucker. Okay, go fuck your mom, okay? then. Yeah, go fuck your mom, then. Go. I, I will can't. Go, I will go down on your mother like Three or thirteen thousand. Hey, shut up. Hello? Thirteen thousand Norwegian. Hello? Norwegian fine. Who's this? Hello, Hello? hotel. What is, what is what is? Yeah, your who's this on the line? I just this called you. Who's this guy? <laughs> yeah, simple enough. Hello, the C W half. The CW? What? Yes. Why Hello? you need you need to discon you need to discontinue the flash. It's a horrible show. Yeah. And Ezra Miller is a fucking psycho. So let, let's go ahead and get the cancellation written up and sent to uh sent over Listen, to the attorney. Here's my here's my pitch. I'm uh I'm four foot eight, <laughs> four hundred and eighty pounds. I think I could be the new flash. He's Okay. Yeah, we want to be the we want we're gonna get the fat flash. It's gonna be a thing. Flash. Uh, yeah, I mean, I mean, uh, a skinny guy running really fast. I mean, that's an everyday thing. But a fat man that could really haul ass—that's another. Can I help you? I mean, are you creative? Can you do a lot of writing? Yeah. Uh, well. Um, I'm, we'll give you we'll give know. we'll give you a production who did you, who did you credit. Think we'll, you the CW. Listen, we'll give you a production credit too, but you're also going to have to run and get coffee. Okay. Well, it's it's I'm I'm not the production company, so. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're going to give you production credit. You're going to do some work, but you're you're also yeah. going to be making a lot of runs to Starbucks. Uh, you'll have to get lots of utensils, creamers. Uh, some of the people want some hazelnut creamers, not just the regular stuff, because um, not a lot of people like black coffee uh, or any of black jelly beans, black licorice, that stuff you need to cross off of your list. We don't like any of that. Uh, a couple of the guys will like some cappuccinos, um, like a fresca. So one guy likes fresca. You'll have to get a fresca. Um, do you know anything about uh, breakfast roll or breakfast sandwiches on bagels? But not that nope. shit from McDonald's that they brought back, okay? None of that. Do you know how to work a skillet? Do you know how to work a, a, a you got a spatula that you can work with? Nope. Okay, so what, what skills do you have? Let me go ahead and get the pen and paper and we'll start the interview. 
What what are your pertinent skills to this job position that you're applying for? Okay, I I don't I don't know who you are or what you you're doing, but um, I my my name is Dwight and I'm your boss. So tell me, what are your pertinent skills for this position what, and why what, are you what, applying? What do you mean you're my boss? You're not my yeah, boss. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm I'm gonna be your boss and I'm gonna tell you where to go and fetch food. Um, and as a woman, I'll mark this down right here: woman, expertise, food cleaning, rearing of the children. What other pertinent skills do you believe that you have? I think you're a dick and you're dying this phone up. Oh, you have excellent voices. Okay, you can do a male's voice if required. Let me mark that down. Well, Dan Express, I'm going to put you on hold. No, please. The fuck no, you are. No, no, you can't. You can't. I'm, I'm driving with Braille. Yeah, that wasn't in our contract. Hello? I'm about to put you on blast. All right. Listen, you may have my signature, but it was not notarized. I'm sorry? You can't hold me responsible for these damages in here. I may have came down and signed a promissory note, but we did not go to a notary and had it notarized. So you guys can pay for your own damages, you better not put one goddamn charge on my card. Um, who are you trying to speak to? The, this is the front desk, right? Uh, what room number are you in? Well, I'm in 215. I just got a call from my credit card company, and they're asking me if I wanted to dispute these charges. You have, you're trying to put a $195 hold on my card? On my card? Um, I'm not aware of that. Let's see. It's noted, it's noted right here. Damage. It damaged right here. It said I stained the carpet when I made pee. <laughs> uh, first what off, you, you can't, first off, you can't prove that. But my last name is Atric, A-T-R-I-C. First name is Barry. <laughs> and you can, you can, you can not, you can not. Because I, I'm incontinent and I have a disability, and you cannot hold this against me and force me into making repairs to, I, and I'm, I'm just going to be frank, a dusty old motherfucking hotel that really should have been tore down back in the 60s. <laughs> okay. So, I need you to take the charges off. Take them off now. Do you, do you understand? I command you. Yep, totally. No, are you in charge or no? Do I need to talk to the higher? Are you the maid or are you the person that worked? I'm at the front desk. There was something on this chart. There was something on this chart. That doesn't mean that, that we'll get into that in a minute. But they said there's a, something about an, es, uh, an, an ethnicity, es, ethnic charge on here. It says Caucasian. It said Caucasian charge. <laughs> Did it? Well, that's what the, they said on the card. They said, hey, I called MasterCard, and they said, hey, hey, where do you get off being Caucasian? They charge you a Caucasian charge. Where do, they, where do they do that at? Well, they said it was in the notes, you know, kind of like in a check when you write in the memo area. That's what it was charged. It was charged. I got a Caucasian charge. Well, that's terrible. If anything, if, if it is, if anything, that should have got me a discount. I know, right? I agree. I, well, I, I don't. I don't want to say I have privilege. I've never exercised this privilege, but in this case, it sounds like that I might have to. <laughs> I agree. So, with do you. you have access to the? Do you have access to the computer? I'm at the front desk. Okay, go ahead and write on there right now. Say privilege to the man. Privilege to the man. Yeah, to me, which I am the man. And what was your name again? Barry Atrix? Yes. You can call okay. me Barry if you'd like. Okay. <laughs> Why are you laughing? What is your problem? Oh, no, I'm not laughing at all. Are you is calling that, me stupid? Is that a, no, sir. No. Is that everything you need? Yeah. I just need the charges reversed, please. God bless you. God bless you and your little ethnic heart. Oh, 
thank you. See, I need that discount. You're, you're welcome. Well, I have an extra card. Are you, I mean, are you single? I am. Okay, well, uh, let me ask you this, because we're not in front of each other right now. How old are you? I am. No, you, all right. I know. I, I know it's not appropriate to ask a woman her age. You, you, how about a, 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 a five-year range? I am younger than thirty-five, and between thirty and thirty-five. Okay. Okay. I can. I, I can work with that. How long is your longest relationship? Does that really count as a person? Like, can you really determine anything off of that? No, but I no, but I will ask you a question that will determine if we're gonna uh, be, I guess, have like a short term relationship, like two weeks or less, or if we're gonna get married. Are you ready for this question? Sure. <laughs> I have kids. Okay. I hop. I I hop or Waffle House. Kids don't matter. <laughs> okay. You what now? I hop. I I hop or Waffle House. Um, I hop. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I can see us going places then. How many children do you have? <laughs> uh, four. You have four. Okay. What is, what, uh, let's go with the, the range again. What is the youngest and what is the oldest? 15 and seven. 15 and 7, okay, so they could be mildly independent, entertain themselves, don't have to have a lot of attention. So there is some alone time to be had there with ourselves. Um, uh, do they do they game? Are they into gaming? Are you into gaming? Yes. Okay, all right, so gaming is a plus. Uh, do you watch the Twitches? Do I? No. Okay, but do, do the children's, the <laughs> child's? No. Okay, that's good because there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of of uh, people that have bad reputations or bad influences. So that's good. You're you're a great mother. Um, okay, all right. What 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 type of toppings do you like on your pizza? Uh, do you like do yes, you like pineapple. pepperoni? I like I like pineapple and pepperoni. Uh, well, those are good choices. Um, like kind of like the whole Hawaiian thing. Like even if you did a uh, like a barbecue chicken, you know, barbecue chicken pizza with mushrooms, jalapenos, uh, like that type of thing is good. It's all right. Um, oh, oh, okay. Well, size feet. <laughs> I think I should be asking you these questions. I hey, I'm open to questions. I'm just saying I'm rifling them off left and right. I mean, they, basically these are prerequisites uh, <laughs> for me to even consider you as a uh, a legitimate uh, partner. Okay, okay. All right. Do you keep your toenails painted or are they chipped? Like currently, if you took your shoes off and looked, are they fully painted, not painted at all, or are they chipped? Oh, they're um, due for due for painting. Hello, how are you? Okay, but you but but you recognize that. Do, do you need, do you need to handle this guest? Do you want me to uh, to pause questions? Yes. Could you call back? Okay. Okay. Just, yep. Um, well, I'll just put the phone down. I'll just I'll wait. I want I want to listen to how you handle this guest. I want to get a uh, a grasp of uh, your personality. There she went. I was, I was really trying to stall her on X for sake if you had to step up. Come to the seats. How can I help you? Hello? Hi, honey. Hi. My shoes fell off. Yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, how can I help you? My shoes fell off. What do you not understand about my shoes? They're off. What is, Hi. what is what is your email? Thank you for calling. Thank you for calling Best Western Santa Fe and Amarillo. How can I help you? 
I don't know. What What is your job? Like, maybe you can assist me in some way, but I don't know what your qualifications are. What What is your highest level of education completed? Not, do, do you know? Hi, Barry. Hey, Barry. Are you Great Barrier Reef? Oh. Barry, answer the question, sir. Hello, Barry. Barry, your dick hit me. Barry. Yes. Yes, sir. Oh, good. Oh, good. Hello. Yes, we need to make a room booking immediately, sir. For one day. Uh, today. Do you have room vacancies or no? Okay. What time are you coming? I'm coming right now. Okay, then come on in. Oh. oh yeah. Come on. Barry. Barry, I love you. I love you, Dad. Barry, no. Barry. Will you be there? Barry, I think you dropped your phone or something. I think Barry's a chooch. Barry! Barry, no! Bariatric! Away! Hi, there's a man. He's a, he's here in the hallway. He's beating me about the ass with a cane. What do I do? Do I call you? Can you do something? Uh, where? He's here. He's in the room, and next to the room, you know, the hallway. And he took the room numbers off the wall. And he's chewing on them. I'm going to beat your ass with this pillowcase full of death bars of soap. You're not fully clean what with do your death fully clean, motherfucker. I'm confused in this situation. I uh, just call the cops, sir. Oh, no, I don't know about that. Because I don't, I don't need that kind of attention, you know? That's why uh, I'm calling you. You know, yeah. I just want to, is, is there like an old man remover here? Can no. Remove the old man? Uh, if he has a room, then he, he's able to stay because he has a room. But he's allowed to spank me like a horse? No, no, he's not allowed to do that. That's what I'm saying. Well, that's what he's doing here. Uh, is he in your room right now? No, 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 he's in the hallway. He, every by, time I w walk by his room, he sticks his cane out and he smacks me. Huh. All right, Is well. Is that normal? Like, no, that's not normal. I never had that before here, so I'm a... Uh, well, what do I do? Just try to avoid him, sir, I guess. Because I don't know what room he's in, because he, he took the room numbers off the door of the wall, and he's chewing on the plastic. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is... That is weird. Uh... -huh. Here, I'm going to hand the phone over to him because he's getting a little erratic and I'm a little worried that he's going to, like, start hitting me on the head or something. Here, dude, just take the phone. Oh. Hey, give me this. So, listen, I went down to Dollar General and I got a hell of a deal. I got 18 bars of zest soap, like nice, solid bars of soap. Then I went in my room and I took the pillow out of the pillowcase and I unwrapped every, every fucking bar out of those 18 packs. And I put them in there, and then I made a knot, right, like a nice knot so they're not loose and they're packed in tight. And I've, I've come into the, this room, and I told this man, I said, hey, let me pet your mane, or I'm going to beat you about the ass with the zest bars of soap, and I'm going to make you zestfully clean. And so now you need to tell him to let me do it, or, or I'm going to have to beat him about the ass. No, I can't let you happen. I can't let, that, let you do that, sir. Well, I'm going to come down to the front desk, and I'm going to need you to sign a piece of paper saying that he, if he says no, that I'm allowed to beat him about the ass with bars uh, of zest. Okay, come down to the front. I'll come down to the front, and if that's not acceptable, I can always go get some uh, some limes or lemons, and I will zest the skin into the, into the pillowcase, and I will beat him about the ass with orange zest. That'll okay, make hey, Baba. Hi. 
โอ้มาบ้าไอ้แม่ can't have my phone back no no let me beat you about the ass and I'll give you the phone back otherwise the phone is mine okay I'm gonna have to call the you know I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep the phone I don't want to deal with them but I'm gonna have but the phone is but the phone is mine I'm gonna keep the phone can I keep the phone Yeah. Thank you for calling to pay attention next to this. This is Claire speaking. How may I help you? Claire? That's a fat girl's name. This is Super 8 in Clayton, New Mexico. My name is Clara. Yeah, but have you, you ever watched The Breakfast Club? Have you ever watched The Breakfast Club? Yes. Okay. Uh, So you, you're you're familiar with it. How many times have you watched it? Uh, it hasn't been for a while, but I've watched it all throughout my childhood. Okay, so you're you're familiar with Judd Nelson's character as John Bender when he told Molly Ringwald, yeah. who was who was Claire Standish, and he said that was a fat girl's name, and basically told her she's gonna get fat when she gets older. Yeah. That's your future. Nope, I'm a skinny mini. Okay. Oh, all right. I I don't believe this, but I'll play the game. How tall are you? Uh, five six. Five six. All right. And I'm not going to ask you your exact weight, but give me a twenty pound swing. I'm a hundred pounds flat. At five six. Yeah. And how long have you had an eating disorder? I eat small. Um, Amounts throughout the day. You need no, well, okay, so like a, you need a, you need a you need a man you, you need a man to feed you. Sir, are you making a reservation you, or not? Well, I don't know yet. You sound. I don't want Skeletor chasing me throughout the halls of a uh, hotel. Um, so let me let me ask you this: What type of foods do you like? Favorite thing right now is Chinese. Chinese. Okay, all right. What a Chinese. I can understand Chinese. Lo uh, mein, you, let me burgers, guess. You're Gen- fries. Oh, oh lo mein. That's not Chinese. What do you? What are you going to the one of those people that goes to buffet? You go to the Chinese buffet and they're eating the fries and the frozen pizza that they put out. All the cheap shit. No. No. Okay. Did you know that horses I was like apples? Listing off foods I eat. Okay. Do you get burgers from any specific place? Do you hit up Five Guys? Do you go to McDonald's? Do you do homemade? Both. I don't usually go to Five Guys, but I do McDonald's and homemade. Okay, but which do you prefer? If I don't usually have to make it, I usually go to McDonald's. McDonald's. uh, Okay. Do you get the regular? You get the single. You get a. Uh, McDouble. Do you get the bacon McDouble? There's also the triple cheese. I don't know which one are you into. I usually get the single, and I usually eat like three of those. Uh, three single, but wouldn't it be more cost effective if you just went with the triple and you got the three patties, and you're not paying for three individual burgers? Don't get exasperated yeah. okay. now. Our whole relationship is our whole relationship is going to be like this. You need to just get used to it. I do have somebody in front of me. Okay, go ahead and just put the phone down, and we'll continue our conversation, Boo. Hi. Hey, Baba. I do. I do. Oh, Mama. This Western Cocopelli Lodge in Clayton. This is Jacob. May I help you? Uh, hi, Jacob. How you doing, honey baby? Yeah, decipher that motherfucker. Yeah. We're in the hotel right now. We're we're knocking on people's doors and we're calling them and we're making obscene phone calls. And we're beating each other about the ass with a bag full of. With zest bars. 
We're getting real zesty in here. Oh, I'm sorry, who is this? <laughs> the zesty boys are here to stay and play in your hotel machine today. Yeah, we're getting ready. We're getting ready to play. Thanks for calling Casa Lemos. Excuse me. Excuse me, that's Sa another one for you. Salud. Take that. Yeah, Salud. Uh, Bencho. Take, yeah, Bencho. Oh, no, wait. Are you Italian? No, this is, I'm Spanish. You're Spanish? Ah, Maro. Oh, no, no, but uh, puta. Here goes that. <laughs> so what can I do for you? Put well, I've been experiencing a lot of sneezing every time I think about Puta Madre. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, so what do I do? I'm, I'm like, I'm in the bathroom right now, and, and I'm trying to work the toilet, but you have a left-handed toilet handle here, and I'm right-handed. How do I do? You, you Use your right hand. But I, But it's left-handed. And you can't flush it? No, because it's a left-handed handle, and I'm right-handed. Okay, so I guess you're going to have to learn to use your left hand. But I'm not ambidextrous <laughs> like that. I I'm, I don't go to the left porium where Ned, Ned Flanders fucking works. I mean, come on now. Can't you put me in a room that has a right-handed toilet flush? I, I don't know. I don't even know. I, I never heard even the term left-handed or right-handed. They're probably all going to be on the left-hand side. In fact, but now yeah, that I think but it's of it, left yeah, it's left-handed. Yeah, it's left-handed, and I'm right-handed, so I, 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 don't, I, I don't know I how don't, to, I can't I, reach. I, I never heard the right-handed uh, toilet handle, sir. I'm sorry. I can't even reach all the way across my body to do this, so I don't know how, how do I do. What do I do? Uh, I'm sorry, so you have a great night. Uh, okay. Thank you for calling Budget Host and RV Park. This is Mary. Hi, Harry. Hello. How are you doing, Harry? This is Mary. Right, Harry. No, this is Mary. Hey, is that Jerry on the phone? Yeah, I think it is. Here, let me give my brother the phone. <laughs> Budget host on RV Park, how may I help you? Hi, we're, I'm trying to reach the front desk uh, looking for Ben and Jerry. Uh, front desk of uh, Budget host. Yeah, yeah, um, we're looking for uh, Rudy Tootie Fresh and Fruity. No, there's no one there. Not, not at the front desk? Nope. Okay, you can, you try the, the, well, can you try the truth yet, desk? No, I think you got the wrong number, sir. Uh, have a good day. Okay, well. Hey, I no, think no, you're no, a no. liar, sir. I think yeah, you're I a think goddamn you're dirty liar. liar. I think you're full of cactus ass, you motherfucker. Sunset Viewing LLC, how may I help you? Hello? Hey there, stupid. What's up? What are you doing? What's your uneducated ass up to? Sunset View in. Hello? Hello, Sunset View in. Hi. Is Harry there? Harry, I wouldn't be able to tell you if he was or not. Ah, uh, shit. Well, he's the guy that, you know, he hangs out by the dumpster. Yeah, I still wouldn't be able to tell you. Uh, Alright, well... If you see him, yep. tell him what? What? You're already you're jumping to conclusions here, buddy. Yeah, if you no. see Harry, if you see Harry. Hey, dude, hey, right? don't call back here anymore. All right, bye. And I'm going to run a movie. Hello? Cozy Mountain Motel, how can I help you? Hi, I need to make a room booking. For what day? Uh, today, tomorrow, no. and for yesterday. Tonight. What do you mean for today and yesterday? You want to, like, time travel, go back in time? Because yep. I'll charge you for that if you think you can. 
Yeah, yeah. Charge me as much as you can at the Pokemon Hotel. The Pokemon Hotel. Well, this is the Cozy Mountain Motel. I don't know what the Pokemon Hotel is. Yeah, this one. That's it. Yeah. What's your name? Horse. Okay, well, I mean, do you want to make a reservation tonight? The last name's Horse. First name is Crazy. Crazy Horse. Okay, yeah. everything is no animals and no smoking. Is that okay? I'm a horse. Is that a problem? Rob, why are you calling me? Oh, you know. <laughs> you didn't think I didn't know who you were? <laughs> yeah, I was blocking my number. I thought you, you know. This, this, this is Rob, right? Yeah, I'm Rob. Hi. Okay, hi, Rob. All right. Hi. All right. Yeah, I'm, jerking, go. All right. I'm jerking my gherkin while looking at All right. Uh, Talk to you later. Picture okay, of a horse. bye. Bye. You just called me. Who is this? Hi, this is the Quality Inn in Suites in Clayton, New Mexico. Sorry for missing your call. Uh huh. Were you needing to make a reservation? Oh shit! I'm sorry, ma'am. It must be a wrong number because I just got a scam likely up. Oh yeah, no, sorry about that. There was a voicemail, but it was like. What number? I don't know how to. Uh, it came from your number. It says you're anonymous on the callback for you, but the voicemail is um, also from your number. What number? Uh, it is... Uh-huh. Let's see. What number just called uh, you prior to me that you think is a scam? Uh, it says you are... Hold on a second, ma'am. I can't one... hear you very well. Hold on. Oh. Okay, Sorry. what number called you prior to you calling me? Hi. I ain't playing Hi. shit, ma'am. It says, uh, I just got a call from you saying it was a scam likely, so I think you got the wrong number. I'm I'm sorry about that. It showed you guys were a missed call for us a couple minutes ago. Nah, yeah, I think so, actually. There's a good chance of that. <laughs> yeah, so I was just calling back because I thought you were trying to make a reservation for our hotel. Well, what the fuck are you then? The quality in and suites. What number did you just try to call? I tried calling us. Bitch, don't fucking throw three, those fucking shade at me, three, motherfucker. Two, I'm calling five. you back trying to be halfway decent. You called the wrong fucking number. What number did you just call prior to this? What do you mean, call just prior to you? What the fuck are you talking about, bitch? Like 30 seconds ago, I had a call from this exact number that I called it back. I'm sorry, I, I don't have any. This is the only missed call I got was the one from you. What the fuck are you talking about? Well, what about my mother? She's dead. What do you... What? I'm, I'm sorry. I thought you were trying to make a... What number? Tell me. Us. Motherfucker, you're not... I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What number did you just call prior to this? Tell me. Like, numbers. Quit talking. You're not making any sense. Just tell me a number. What number did you call? Two, Jesus Christ, you're five, stupid. What number did you call four, before this? Four, six, five... <laughs> You're kind of funny, actually. This is making my day. What number did you call me? Tell me. I called uh -huh. 325. What fucking number? Five. Tell me, lady. You're that fucking dumb. Number what I number did you just try call. to call? Tell me. Was it 427? I, I, I will repeat the number. It here. is. What are you talking number about? Dogs. Do you like fucking dogs three, or something? You're weird, lady. Two, just tell me. Number five. What the number fuck seven, are you talking three. about, lady? Are you going to hook me up? Uh, yeah, we have some double queens left. Sounds like they you got the fucking hookups there, ma'am. You bet you got the, the fucking best drug dealers are in number, town. Our are $149, with tax they're $168.56. And I if wish. you're paying with cards, there's a 3% surcharge of $5.06. <laughs> what number are you calling, ma'am? Three is the area code, and then the other digits are... What's going on here? Do you a fucking crackhead? Okay, so so you want the room or not? Well, you sound like a crackhead to me. Are you wanting the hotel room or not for the night? My mom's chiming in. You're fucking retarded. What number did you call? Was it four, Did it start with the 427? No, it started with the 325. You sound like a fucking robot, lady. Like, I, I don't think you're understanding me. You just called me, and I'm calling you back. 
Yes, and I'm trying to get and I'm trying to see what room you want. All we have left are double queens at our hotel. Why the fuck would you call me first? I'm trying to ask you what fucking number you called, idiot. I'm I'm telling you, it says anonymous, but when you click on the little info number, the little info, the thing that's like the I that's in the circle to see the more info for the missed call. Was it four, the number it that I four two seven? Is the or are you gonna be that fucking hard headed and retarded? What number starts with a four two seven? I don't have any phone numbers with a four two seven. Nothing. The only phone number I had with the missed call for the night starts with a three two five. That's what I fucking figured. And that's... Jesus Christ, lady. So are you wanting so are you wanting the hotel room or not? What did the fucking number start with? I think you got a wrong number here. The phone number starts with a three, a two, and a five for the area code. Jesus, you're a jackass. Is that not your number? Did I call the wrong number? Could call back? Do because it's the three two five is the area code that it starts with. The full number that I am calling is three two five dash seven three. Is that not the number I am calling? You just called me. Who is this? This is the quality in. Sorry for missing your call. I was away from the desk at the moment. Uh huh. Um. Oh shit! I'm sorry, get, man. It must be a wrong or... number because I just got a scam. Likely got. Oh yeah, no problem. Um, sorry about that. What number? What do you mean? What number? What number for what? Uh huh. What what number for what? I don't understand. What number just called you prior to me that you think is a scam? Uh, the number that just called me was. Hold on a second, ma'am. I can't hear you very well. Hold on. Okay, what number called you prior to you calling me? Say uh, that the again. The number that called me prior was. I ain't playing shit, ma'am. So I think you got the wrong number. Oh, I'm sorry uh, yeah, about I that. think so, actually. There's a good chance of that. <laughs> you just called me. Who is this? Uh-huh. Oh, shit. I'm sorry, man. It must be a wrong number because I just got a scam likely. Uh, what number? What number? Uh huh. Hello. What are you talking about? What? How do you know my number? What? What is my phone number? Hello? Hey, this is the Quality Inn in Suites in Clayton, New Mexico. Sorry for missing your call. Is this Silas Aldrich? What are you talking about? Uh, we got a missed call from your number just a moment ago, and I was calling back to see if you were wanting to book a room or if it was something else you were needing help with. What? Uh, for booking a room here at the Quality Inn. How do you know my number? It was the number that came up as the missed call. What? What is my phone number? It is. Okay. What is my phone number? Four, it is three two five four six five for Silas Aldridge. What, what is What is my phone number? Three two five. Yeah, I'm getting phone calls. 
No, you just no, called no, me. We've been getting scammed. We've been getting threatened for the last hour and a half. Hello, this is Equality and Swiss and Clyde in New Mexico. Sorry for missing your call. How may I help you? You I, ain't done to be halfway decent when you're calling a woman me. a motherfucker. Yes. Excuse me, 30 oh, seconds, no. you called it back. You didn't speak to me 30 seconds ago. What do you mean, this is the first time I've called you all back? It's the same voice that's on the recording, y'all. Huh? It's the same voice. Are you guys wanting to make a reservation for the night? Shut the fuck up and I will. Okay. Um, all we have left are some double queens. They're 149 which has it's 16856 And if you're going to be paying with a the card, there is a service fee of 2%, which makes it $5.06 for that. Shut the fuck up. So you don't, you don't want them? Shut your state shut your dick up your mama's ass. Oh, crawl cool. back in the hole you came out of, you dick face. Okay, so I will go ahead and reserve the room for you. How about that? How about my Glock? You want to play with my Glock? I mean, if we're talking sexually. You want to play with my Glock? One I mean, we talking sexually, like vaginally, mouth stuff. If you shut up and listen, we'll tell you. Otherwise, we're just gonna keep insulting you because you're a stupid motherfucker. Okay. All right. So, what's the last name for the reservation? And I ain't no goddamn robot. Okay, and the first name? And your voice was talking about sucking my private parts on a video, okay. and they got your voice now. All right, and the address? I told you 15 times that you shut the fuck up. I'll give it to you, but you don't know how to shut your goddamn mouth on there. Okay, and what kind of card will you be using to hold the room? Because every time I try to spit out the number, you start running your mouth. All right. Looks like we got you in there, Silas, and we will see you in a little bit. Have a nice night. That's what I fucking figured, stupid ass. Hello? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What? What? How do you know my number? How do you know my number? What is my phone number? What What is my phone number? Hello? Oh, you just called me to get the scam. We've been getting threatened for the last hour and a half. What are you talking about? I just told you halfway decent when you call me, motherfucker. What? How do you know my number? You called it back. You didn't speak to me 30 seconds ago. What? What is my phone number? Okay, what is my phone number? Shut the fuck up, and I will. What is what is my phone number? Shut the fuck up. Yeah, I'm getting phone calls. Shut your state shut your dick up your mama's ass. Dude, this is so funny. 